Never state facts that you don't know. If you don't know the answer to a question, reply that you do not know. Never guess or reply with an answer that is not completely true just because you don't want to appear ignorant. The opposing attorney may interpret your answer to be misleading or untruthful and try to use it against you. Remember, I do not know and I do not recall are perfectly acceptable answers during a deposition if that is in fact the truth. If you are confident, you can answer a question by using a range. For example, if you don't know an exact time, you can say something along the lines of it occurred between 1 p.m. and 2 p.m. Never give your opinion about something. Only provide facts. Typically, your attorney will object if the opposing attorney asks for your opinion about something. Follow your attorney's advice on whether to answer the question, but never give your opinion. Do not try to justify or qualify your answer. Remember, just provide facts. Only answer the question asked. Don't go off topic. Do not agree to provide any additional information and don't agree to give an answer sometime in the future. Only provide information you have. Do not interrupt your attorney. If your attorney interrupts your answer, stop and wait until your attorney advises you on what to do next. Do not answer the question if your attorney tells you not to answer. The only person who can force you to answer is a judge. Under the Fifth Amendment to the U.S. Constitution, you never have to answer a question if that answer would qualify as an admission to a crime. Do not rush your answer. Take your time and breathe. The transcripts from the deposition do not show how much time you took to answer the question. The transcript only shows what you said. Tell the truth. Do not lie. Your attorney cannot explain away your lies or bury the truth. Be respectful of the deposition process. Don't be sarcastic or hostile. Your humor or sarcasm may make you much less likable to a jury. Do not volunteer any information. Just answer the question. Do not get emotional, angry, or upset. If you do, you may say things that can be used against you. Finally, stay calm. You're going to get through it, and your attorney has your back.